Practice listening. Topic. ADB maintains Vietnam's 2022 GDP growth forecast at 6.5%. Vietnam's economy was expected to grow 6.5% in 2022 and by 6.7% in 2023, according to a recent report from the Asian Development Bank, ADB. The report says Vietnam's economic growth will be strongly supported by trade expansion, faster than expected manufacturing recovery, travel, and the disbursement of public investment. However, the economy is facing difficulties due to a worsening external economic environment brought on by aggressive monetary tightening in advanced nations. The economy's inflation estimates are kept between 3.8 and 4.0 percent since, after meeting external demand, the food supply will be sufficient. Southeast Asia's inflation forecast for 2022 is raised significantly from 3.7% to 4.7%. Bank Indonesia, the central bank, expects inflation to hit 4.5% by December. Inflation in the Philippines accelerated to 6.1% in June and averaged 4.4% in the first half. Inflation forecasts for Thailand are revised up from 3.3% to 6.3% for 2022 and from 2.2% to 2.7% for 2023 mainly because rising energy prices and higher cost pass-throughs are expected to affect prices for a wider range of products. In Malaysia, lower headline inflation due to price controls and subsidies on oil and basic food products prompts a downward revision in 2022's inflation forecast. In the smaller economies, rising fuel prices and a significant currency drop against the US dollar are building up pressure on inflation, particularly in the Lao PDR and Myanmar. Practice listening topic 2. Google fires software engineer who claimed its AI chatbot is sentient. Alphabet Inc.'s Google said on Friday it has dismissed a senior software engineer who claimed the company's artificial intelligence. AI, chatbot Lambda was a self-aware person. Google, which placed software engineer Blake Lemoyne on leave last month, said he had violated company policies and that it found his claims on Lambda to be wholly unfounded. It's regrettable that despite lengthy engagement on this topic, Blake still chose to persistently violate clear employment and data security policies that include the need to safeguard product information a Google spokesperson said in an email to Reuters. Last year, Google said that Lambda, language model for dialogue applications, was built on the company's research showing transformer-based language models trained on dialogue could learn to talk about essentially anything. Google and many leading scientists were quick to dismiss Lemoyne's views as misguided saying Lambda is simply a complex algorithm designed to generate convincing human language Lemoyne's dismissal was first reported by Big Technology, a tech and society newsletter. Practice listening topic 3. Para Games athletes promise to bring home golds. HCM City. Vietnamese athletes with disabilities are ready for medals at the 11th ASEAN Para Games after their send-off ceremony on Thursday morning in HCM City. A 153-strong contingent including 120 athletes and 18 coaches will compete in eight sports. Athletics, swimming, powerlifting, badminton, table tennis, chess, judo and archery. Among 14 available in Solo, Indonesia. This will be a tough competition for Vietnam. In the last three years, most athletes have no chance to compete locally and internationally. Only a small number of them, who were excellent were qualified for big events such as the Tokyo Paralympics, said Nguyen Hong Min, deputy director of the Vietnam Sports Administration, at the ceremony. Sport events were postponed and delayed because of the pandemic. This created challenges for managers to select the best athletes for the Para Games, added Min who is Vietnam team's chef de mission. Speaking at the ceremony, Deputy Minister of Culture, Sports and Tourism Hoang Dao Quang asked athletes to play hard for the best results while strictly following rules and regulations. The athletes were also Vietnamese ambassadors to introduce and popularize Vietnam's beautiful images and friendly people to the world. World silver medalist in powerlifting Le Van Cong and track and field athlete Nguyen Thi Noc Thuy promised to bring the highest possible result home, equivalent to 40 gold medals. The 11th Para Games will be held from July 30 to August 6, 
Originally it was set to be hosted by Vietnam in 2021, but it was cancelled due to the COVID-19 pandemic before being transferred to Indonesia. Earlier, the 10th edition of the ASEAN Para Games was cancelled by the hosts the Philippines due to a lack of funding stemming from the COVID-19 pandemic. In the last ASEAN Para Games in 2017 in Kuala Lumpur, Indonesia topped the podium with 126 golds, followed by Malaysia, 90, and Thailand, 68. Vietnam with 142 athletes placed fourth grabbing 40 golds and setting 11 records. Athletics and swimming were the delegation's strongest sports. VNS.